Can you please spell Gabbana? This is it. This is the line. Well, I don't eat anything, and when I feel like I'm about to faint, I eat a cube of cheese. <laughs> Anne Hathaway and Emily Blunt revisiting some of their most iconic Devil Wears Prada quotes. That's all. The former co-stars reunited for Variety's Actors on Actors, where they took a look back at the classic film and their unforgettable lines. Oh, I'm sorry, do you have some prior commitment? Do you have some hideous skirt convention to go to? <laughs> I have to say, there's something about your particular voice saying the word hideous. Hideous. It just hits in this really good <laughs> spot. I wanted to make her a bit John Cleese, you know, and that kind of physical comedy and um, larger than life. And I just felt a kind of very pronounced British accent can be really irritating and, and patronizing and makes her sound more highly strung. While Emily's character, who's also named Emily, is full of snark in the 2006 film, the two recall Anne's take on Andy, who's brand new to the fashion industry. Can you please spell Gabbana? Can you please spell Gabbana? Hello? Guess not. That's a line Anne says still follows her around, even on vacay. I was in Italy uh, recently and I showed up at the hotel and they'd baked a cake. I arrived in my hotel room to a cake and on, they'd written on the top, can you please spell Gabbana? Oh. That is, is so- that not the greatest? It's the greatest. It was just a testament to people's love of the movie and how deeply they'd taken that film in and that's just a wonderful feeling. I just feel lucky. Meanwhile, Emily says this might be the one she hears most from fans. My flight attendant coming over went- um, I love that. I'm still working on my stomach flu. <laughs> It was so cool. And I was like, oh yeah. Gosh. And then people also misquote that I'm one stomach flew away from my goal weight. Oh, I'm just one stomach flew away from my goal weight. Do they you correct kind of them? Or do you let them live in it? No, I just let them say it because okay, I think the right there's choice. various versions, you know. This is it. This is the line. Well, I don't eat anything. And when I feel like I'm about to faint, I eat a cube of cheese. <laughs> <laughs> Can we? Can we? One of the most iconic lines in cinema history, Emily. <laughs> it turns out people really like the Devil Wears Prada. And it turns out people really like this Emily quote. You eat carbs for Christ's sake. You eat carbs for Christ's sake, God, I think was the line. It's so unfair. Pudding. It's so unfair. <laughs> so unfair. And of course, it's not The Devil Wears Prada without the one-liner queen herself, Miranda Priestly. Is there some reason my coffee isn't here? Has she died or something? <sighs> By all means, move at a glacial pace. Because you you know, know how that thrills, thrills me. me. Emily is just, we just really bonded on The Devil Wears Prada. The ladies have remained close since the film and can't help but reminisce about how it all began. Did we meet before the table read at Devil Wears Prada? Was it at the table read? This is so embarrassing because I remember every second of the first time I met you and you're like, did we? Emily and I, honestly, it's, it's funny because um, even if we hadn't worked together and been so close, I think we would have found each other in life and just become great pals. She's one of my favorite people in the whole world. And I just kind of look at her, I'm like, I so want to be you. You're just so bright and sparkling and funny. I remember walking into the room and like turning and meeting you. And I just remember going like, hi buddy, in my head. Oh. And instant thought, I was like, what a movie star. What? First thought, I th I like, there was like, you were like shedding stardust. It was crazy. Are you getting this? <laughs> and I just remember um, thinking to myself, Emily Blunt is going to be the biggest deal. 